What's up, everybody? It is Friday. I'm Coach Brian Sham from the San Francisco Bay Area. Today, Coach Ray is teaching, and um, we are going to be doing a fun little circuit of, I believe it's seven exercises or six. What is it, Ray? Six exercises. Six in the exercises. Tennis. Yeah, so it's a little bit different today. We're going to do uh, each exercise four times, and it's called a descending pyramid model. Our first set we're gonna do for 50 seconds and by the way let's just go ahead and move right now let's get a little jog in place or something let's get loose let's get moving 50 seconds it'll be our first set our second set will be 40 seconds after a 10 second rest then we're gonna go to a 30 second interval and then finally to a 20 second interval so on the first set again it's longer than the fourth right so I want you to pace yourself a little bit longer but I want you to challenge yourself for 50 seconds but on your fourth set I want you to get after it it is like balls to the walls as they say 20 seconds of work 10 seconds of rest on that final set so think about adding weight with each set because it is going to be lower in duration okay so let's go over the workout right now with ray i'm gonna talk through it with you guys so here's ray what's up all right hey. <laughs> let's go on um, let's all do these together okay let's go feet hip width right now we're just gonna do some squats Let's do some squats. So this workout in the past was a partner workout, was a partner workout. And I want you to imagine somebody's facing you and you have a ball in your hand, okay? So when we do this exercise, you have a ball. Okay, let's do a couple more of those. So feel your little toes and your outer foot. And we're gonna press up as you explode up. And now imagine you're going over a volleyball net. We're gonna be jumping over a volleyball net and imagine blocking somebody Imagine someone trying to block you on the other side. That was what we were doing when we had our in-person workouts. All right, number two, we're gonna go to push-ups. Let's just do some real basic push-ups right now on your knees. So let's do those, guys. Inhale down, exhale up. Remember on all push-ups and planks, keep the belly in to support you. We don't want that belly to escape. Elbows in, spread your fingers. Now, every time you come up, in the ideal world, I want you to bring your arm up like you're high-fiving a partner in front of you. Now, that adds a, a layer of instability, right? You've got to have more strength, more stability when you have one arm up. If you can, go wide feet, get off those knees. You could also put your hands on the couch. Number three, medicine ball lunges with a chest pass or a handoff. In the old days, we were facing each other in this partner workout model. Let's all keep doing this together. We're gonna go one leg at a time. Yep, there we go. And we're just gonna drive arms and legs. So that is number three. Number four is lateral lunge with a trunk rotation. So let's get a couple of these in right now. So start with your feet about hip width. Inhale, rotate, exhale back. Remember, inhale on the step on all lunges. Exhale, push back. Okay, let's get the other side. We're rotating over the lead leg. Inhale, exhale, explode back. Get that timing. All right, next one will be number five. It is the T drill. So imagine there's a, a T in front of you and you're gonna go in a T format. Shuffle left, shuffle right, come back to center of the T, back pedal, do a couple of those. Forward pedal, lateral shuffle, lateral shuffle the other way, to the center point, back pedal. That is our T. And the last one will be a row with a squat. So this is best done. Oh, Ray found a uh, way yeah. to anchor. There you go. <laughs> All right, so if you have a band, it works best, okay? If you only have dumbbells, you can use dumbbells. It's just a weird angle. So um, we're gonna row and squat. Let's all do it together. Come on, guys, come on. Come on, Melanie, pick it up, Ego. Come on, guys. Squeeze your shoulder blades, low hands. This can get your heart rate up really high if you push it, but it's all about what you put into it. So you get what you put into it, right? So let's do it, everybody, and have some fun. And uh, reminder, I did say it earlier before I recorded it, but Monday is Labor Day and we will only have one 9 a.m. session. I will be teaching that. Feel free to invite your friends and family members to that class. All right, my friends, let's get this going. So hands right below shoulders. And working around the wrists. Wide fingers working around the wrists. 
Good, other direction here. Thanks for making time for you this morning. Good, hands out to the sides here, hands out to the sides. One thing we talked about on Wednesday, let's go one hand forward, one hand back, was these, this idea of a transition, of wearing different hats. Think of like a hat rack at your house. Um, just think of all the different hats that you wear in a day, the different roles that you play in your house, outside the house, and thinking about how you transition from one to the next. It's crucial, switch hands if you haven't, it's crucial that you have a transition point. When you think of Superman, right? He transitions from Clark Kent to Superman in a phone booth, right? When he's Clark Kent, he's not thinking about Superman. When he's Superman, let's go left leg out. He's not thinking about Clark, Clark Kent. Hips forward, hips back. So thinking about a couple transitions in your own life that you need to have that are crucial to your success in that role. So right now, you have your exercise hat on. Right, so if you're thinking about having your, and I know it's not always perfect and ideal, but if you have your mom hat on or your dad hat on, or your work, um, it's window show wipe the leg, or your work hat on, uh, it gives you, it does not allow you to have full attention on what is happening right now. Let's go right leg out. So think about who you need to be right now. Be who you need to be when you need to be that person. Be here now. Let's reach for the toes at Notre Dame. I know they have a, a white line for the football players in, on campus. And when they cross that white line, they become Notre Dame football players. They're no longer students, boyfriends, girlfriends, whatever. They're no longer anything except a football player. Let's go knees wide, feet together, and just sit your hips back. So think about what are the transitions that you need to become better at so that you can be your best for yourself and others? And how do you transition into that exercise self right now? This is stretching alone and breathing can be a great transition, getting the body warm and loose. So hips forward, hips back, just telling it, hey, this is time for me, this is time to exercise, this is time to push myself so that I can be healthy, so that I can be strong. Good, right there. And then let's get some knee push-ups in. So that's just some thoughts on transitions and how we can change from one hat to the next. It's finding a threshold in the house where you become your exercise self. Glutes are tight, elbows are corkscrewed, belly buttons drawn in. Let's go for five. And awesome. From there, let's go hips up in the air. Let's spend some time on these calves today. We have that T drill is really going to challenge the calves. Just get them nice and loose, pawing the ground with the heels. Good. Let's walk those up. Slow. Let's stay right here. Hinge at the hips. Hands are back. Let's like one. Let's go left hand down, right hand. We're going to follow it up with our eyes straight up. Breathe into the stretch. Good, bring it down. Other side here. You might find one side a little tighter than the other. Slowly bring it back down. Hinging at the hips, coming up to a standing position. Awesome, my friends. Let's get those ankles. Nice and loose. Thankful to be with you today. We can continue to get the wrists loose here. Heel to toe. So as Brian described, we have six different moves. And each move, we're going to be on the same move for 50 seconds. Toes in. Then a 10-second rest. Then the same exercise for 40 seconds. 10-second rest. 30, 10, 20. After that 20th, we'll have a 30-second transition to our next exercise. Let's go, feet are glued to the ground, hands on the knees, and we're just working around, okay? Keep toes and heels down, you'll get the Achilles stretch, ankle rotation, other direction. Awesome, okay, hands on the hips. 
Good deep breaths. Take your hips back far, bring them forward. Good, right there. We do have rotation, so let's get some rotation, more rotation, I should say. I did this class earlier today. It goes really quick. It's challenging while you're in it, but it goes quick though. Get some arm circles, thumbs up. So if you see me on my phone a lot today, that's because there's no other way than to manually time this. So my job is to keep you focused. You don't have to count today. I'm doing the counting with the timer. Let's go tricep stretch. We'll need that today for our push-up round. Um, so I'm not texting anyone. I'm just helping you get the most out of your workout by keeping track of the times, okay? You won't be able to hear any beepers today because we'll have the music going. So just listen to my voice. I'll give you a countdown when we're on and when we're off. It's going to be fun, my friends. Still, uh, just good, strong posture and drive elbows back. You should actually feel this in the front of the shoulders. Good. Now let's take our hands, put them together. Push, 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 push. You should feel this in the chest, waking up those chest muscles. We're push, we have push right away, both in our first exercise. Um, again, you do not have to use a ball or a weight for those jump squats. But if you want to, you can't. Good, and relax that. Okay, a little bit more shoulder mobility. Reach out, create a C with the shoulder. Good, reach, C. Last one, reach, C. Okay, let's get some neck circles going. Good. Let's look to our left. Slowly come over to the right. Down. Up. Awesome. Okay, let's practice a little bit of that first one. Okay, so we have, so use a regular squat form. We actually want to go a little bit more narrow today so that, think about hips straight down. Okay, so hips are going, going up here we don't have to jump yet if you're not jumping today that's okay i'll show up from the side hips go way back deep slow it up okay my friends that's our first exercise if you want to use a ball or something feel free to grab one we're going to get the tunes going here first round's 50 seconds and we'll have a 10 second break 40 seconds and we'll keep going down from there okay with you here the whole time are we ready my friends three here comes our first round of 50 seconds three two one, here we go. Deep squat. Again, if you can get the jump, great. We'll get some tunes in just a second here. And I'll keep giving you a little, little count. We're at 35 seconds left in round one. Again, I'm really interested in the deep squat more than how high you get. Remember, the feet stay narrow at 25 seconds. We're halfway through this first round. Good. And if you start to really burn, just run in place for a second. Stay in curves and get back into it. Ten seconds. Seven seconds. Three, two, one. Good. Keep the feet moving. That's the end of round one. And we'll push our clock down to 40 seconds now. Three, two, one. Let's go. We're on. Good, I'm watching here. So Ale, let's see if we can put the feet a little closer together. Pretty narrow on this one, yes. Good. There you go, Sherry. Nice job driving up with the legs. That is awesome. 15 seconds left. Good morning, Linda. Second or third round, let's start to get even deeper into those squats, my friends. Annie has got a great pace going. Five, four, three, two, one. Ten second breather. I'm coming back with you. 30 second round coming up. Five, four, three, two. Here we go. We have 30 seconds. Remember the knees, they're going to want to buckle, go out or go in. I want you to keep them stiff as in straight up, straight down. Don't allow them to bow out or bow. 15 seconds. It's back. 
Five seconds. Three, two, one. Awesome. We have a 20 second round left coming up. In five, four, three, two, here we go. 20 seconds. Hips back, explode up. Trying to get off the ground if you can. 10 seconds left. If it burns, keep the feet moving. Get right back in three, two, and relax. Awesome, my friends. 30 second breather. Let's get ready for push ups. See, I told you it goes fast. Whew. That is, that's good. All right, round two. We have push ups. Any push ups that you want. You might have a couple of different stations. I'm going to have a few. Get my yoga blocks ready. You can have a couch if you want. Because as we get more and more tired, you either go to the knee push ups or we elevate uh, our, our position, our hands, I should say. All right, my friends, 10 seconds to go time. First round is 50 seconds of push ups. Are we ready? Three, two, one. Here we go. First round of push ups. See how many we can get in. Hands are right under shoulders. Belly button is drawn in. Quads are drawn in. Glutes are tight. Your body is nice and stiff. We have 27 seconds left. Twenty seconds. Somebody get ten more push-ups. Fourteen seconds. Five seconds. Stay with it. When in doubt, stay in that push-up position. Three, two, one. Awesome. We're gonna go down to forty seconds here. Are we ready? Three, two, one, 40 seconds. Let's do this. Good, glutes are tight, quads are drawn in. There you go, Lair. Good, Susan, there you go. Remember, if you can, high five your partner. High five that partner. They're imaginary, but they're there. Push up, tap, 14 seconds. And we can create that instability. Five seconds, three, two, one, and relax. Great job, take a nice deep breath. I'm gonna go to equalize a row. Again, if you can do a push up, high five somebody, that's awesome. 30 seconds, three, two, one. Here we go. I want you to equalize. If you're using an equalizer, no high fives. That could be bad. Already at 15 seconds. Seven seconds. Get two more. Awesome. Awesome. 20 seconds. Here it comes. Five. Four, three, two, let's go. 20 seconds till victory on the push ups. <sighs> 10 seconds. <sighs> three, two, one. Whoo, that was a spicy round. Good stuff, my friends. Good, good, good. Okay, we got 30 seconds till lunges. Lunges, and we're gonna hand off that Mutt Med Ball. If you have one, good stuff. 
for these lunges, we're going to stay on the same side for half the time. So I'll tell you when to switch, okay? So I'm going to be lunging, handing, core's tight, same side, and then I'll let you know when to switch, okay? All right, are we ready? 50 second round coming up. Grab a med ball if you have one. If not, that's okay. We're just lunging. How's that chest feel? Pretty strong, I hope. <laughs> All right, here we go. Three, two, one. We are on. Same leg for 25 seconds. I'll tell you when to switch. At the bottom, you'll see here, I've got 90 degree angle front leg, 90 degree angle back leg, okay? Core as tight as we press out. 10 seconds on this hand. On this side. Five seconds. Switch legs. Show you face on here. If you have a chance, because next round I'm gonna come watch. If you can show a side view, would be ideal. If it's not happening, that's okay. We have five seconds left. Three, two, awesome. Rest it out for 10 seconds. We have our 40 round coming up. Three, two, one, 40 seconds. Here we go, we are on. Good deep breaths. Good, make sure that our hands, try to get our hands extended if we have something in our hands and then keep the belly button drawn in. It's gonna give you that stabilization. 23 seconds, switch legs. Now, switch legs. If you've already been switching legs, that's okay. If you haven't, Eric's looks good. Maria, good morning. 10 seconds, 10 seconds, stay with it. There you go, Eva. Awesome, three, two, one. Good stuff, my friends. I saw everybody looking good. That 90 degree angle and that toss. Excellent, keep working on that range of motion. 30 seconds, three, two, one. 15 seconds per side, let's do it. We're on. Again, what Brian talked about. Today you'll get it out of it, what you put into it. So if you're going for speed, you're getting a lot of reps, switch sides. Switch sides. If you're getting a lot of reps, you're gonna burn major calories and get that heart rate up. You're gonna be the heart rate up the whole time today. And relax. Hey, all we have left is that 20 second round. What do you say, my friends? Five seconds to that 20 second round. Three, two, one. Let's do it together. Good. Changing views for you here. Switch legs. Three, two, and relax. Great job. Go grab some water. Nice little recovery after those push ups. We have the side lunge with rotation coming up next. Side lunge with rotation. Again, the rotation comes at the end of the movement and is not necessary. Good deep breaths. Keep your feet moving. <sighs> 10 seconds till go time. Side lunge with rotation coming up. Three, two, let's do it. Side lunge, rotate. Same side for 25 seconds. You wanna keep your eyes forward. You'll feel it through the transverse abdominis. Squeeze that ball, or squeeze that object. We've got five more seconds on this side. And we'll switch hips back, explode. Three, two, let's switch sides. Coming towards you, hips back. Almost there. 
Stay with it. Seven seconds. Good. Three, two, one. Awesome. All right, my friends. Round of 40 coming up. I'm going to come check out some form. Three, two, one. Look at those heart rates. We are on. Hey, Dave, let's lead with our heel. So what I mean by that, you're pointing out with your toes. Uh, let's lead with our heel to where our toes are still pointed forward. Keep your toes pointing at your TV the whole time. There you go. Switch legs. Check this out, Dave. This is what I'm seeing. I want to see this. So toes go out. My toes are still facing that way even when I rotate. Three two, one. That was our round of 40 right there. We have 30 seconds coming up in three, two, one. Here we go. 15 seconds each leg. There you go, Susan. Good. Good, strong power back. Swiss legs, Swiss legs. Ava, great job getting that rotation and power back to center. What I mean by that is I'm here, explode yourself back up. Good, five seconds. Three, two, one. We have 20 seconds left. We're doing great, my friends. 20 seconds left in three, two, one. Here we go. We are on. 10 seconds on each side. I'll let you know when to switch. Three, two, Good, switch. That was right. Toes forward and relax. Great, 30 second breather. Hey, we've got one of our, our main cardio exercises coming up next. I'm gonna clear some space. We have that T drill, okay? Where we sprinting forward, side shuffle, Side shuffle all the way across, side shuffle back to the middle, and then backwards run. Looks something like this. Here, tap, tap, get back to the middle, backwards run back, okay? Sound good, my friends? Let's do this, we have 50 seconds on the clock. Three, two, one, we're on, here we go. Let's see if we can get into the orange as a group. Stay in love. 40 seconds. Remember, staying on the ball of the foot. The only time the heel should be touching the ground is on that back pedal. Even then, typically you want it to up. We are halfway through this round, halfway through. Done. 20 seconds. 10 seconds. Five seconds, stay with it. Three, two, one, and relax. 10 second breather. We're down to our 40 second round. Good, three, two, Ava's got some company. Here we go. This is our 40 second round. Accidentally put the 50 seconds, so I'll be watching that drive, drive, drive. There you go, Mel. Cindy's using every inch of that living room. I love it. Way to move, Cindy. Way to move. Good back pedal. Strong back pedal. There you go, Ann. Make sure I keep those arms moving, Linda. Good. Let's pick up those feet. Let's get knees to chest on that, Linda. Keep the feet moving. Let's get high knees, Linda, while you're in place there. There you go, and three, two, awesome. That was our 40 second round. I had it slated for 50 seconds, my bad. Good stuff, Ran I'm still, coming back uh, with you. Nursing okay. my calf injury. That's right, sorry about that. I remember that as I was saying it. Thanks, Linda. All right, my friends, 30 seconds. Are we ready for this? Three, two, one, let's do it. Let's do it. 30 second round. Kind of a different kind of day today. 
tapping into something deep. A 50 second round though makes everything else seem easy. Good. What's that? Three, two, one. Awesome. That's our 30 second round. We just have our 20 second round left in 10 seconds. Easy day right here. Easy day, right, CJ? Best part of our day. Three, two, one. Here we go. 20 seconds. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. Great job, my friends. Awesome. You guys are pushing it today. Hey, again, if you don't have that heart rate monitor, that's totally fine. But if you want to push yourself, I promise if you see, <coughs> excuse me, your numbers on the screen, hold on a second. It is quite motivating. All right, my friends. You also might have another heart rate monitor in another place. Our last exercise before the finisher, deep squat, <coughs> excuse me, with a row. I got something going on in my throat. We'll figure that out. All right, check this out. Deep squat, good strong pull, row. Deep squat, shoulders back and down. So if you don't have bands, <coughs> I do not know what's going on here. You can also use a dumbbell deep squat, bent over row, works pretty similarly, but bands are ideal today. Are we ready for that 50 second round, my friends? Ready or not, here it comes in three, two, one. <coughs> Excuse me. We are on deep squat row. Again, trying to get as deep as we can. Shoulders back and down on that row. And then this round, let's all get into that orange here. You can go for speed or you can go for depth. Your choice, and you can do both. 23 seconds left in round one. Pushing out on the knees. Breathe in, 15 seconds. 10 seconds, stay with it. Get that good glute squeeze at the top. The buns should be on fire. Three, two, one. Ten second breather. Ten second breather. Going down to 40 second round. I'm looking forward to seeing what you guys are using here. Three, two, one. 40 seconds. Let's go. Deep squat. There you go. Amy with the APT bands. I like it. Everybody should be getting into. There you go. And I love it. The TRX, good strong pull. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to challenge you one more by taking a little step in towards anchor point. There you go. Good. good. There you go, Lair. Good strong pulls. Linda looks good. Good pace. Three, two. Awesome. Hey, we have 10 seconds till round of 30. I'm liking what you guys got at the house. We're getting some good equipment there. Whew. 30 seconds. Three, two, one. We are on. 30 second round. Again, like Brian talked about, this, this exercise can get the heart rate up. We're using major body groups right here. The glutes are firing. Quads are working. Good strong pulls work. A lot of back muscles, biceps. Five seconds left. Three, two, one. Awesome. Keep the feet moving. We have a 20 second round left. That's all we have before our finisher. Good stuff. Here we go. Three, two, bam. 20 seconds. What can you get done? I'm going to go for 12. Pick a number you want to get to. 10 seconds. There it is. Three, 
two. Awesome. Walk around, my friends. Walk around. That's a great job right there. Good stuff. Again, we're just getting creative. I've got a band on a couch that's being held down by a 40 pound weight in a five gallon jug of water. Okay, we have a finisher coming up, but let's recoup a little bit. About 30 more seconds. Four rounds, burpees, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. Show you a couple of options for the burpees. If you have a couch and you're getting really tired, use the hands on the couch, take the legs back, okay? Burpees look something like this, coming all the way down, push up all the way up, okay? Or we could do a hip thrust, take the legs back, stick it, pop back up, or certain injuries, we could take one leg back at a time, walk it up, okay? We got that coming up in 10 seconds. Whew. A lot of stuff with timers today. Smooth. All right. 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. Ready? Three, two, one. Round one. 20 seconds. You can hear the bell this time. Pick a number you want to get to each round. Three, two, one. Keep the feet moving. Let's go. Hey, we're all in now. The body is numb, N-U-M-B, numb. It'll do whatever you tell it to do. Let's do it. Three, two, one. Round two. Three, two, one. Keep the feet moving. Good. Five seconds. I'm coming to come say hi. You ready, Sherry? Let's go, Sherry. Three, two, one. We are on. 20 seconds. Here we go. Here you go, Ale. Good. Protect that back. Ale on the way down. Do not allow it to bow. Good. Good, Jennifer. We're almost all there. There you go, Cindy. Amy, how we doing over there? Seven seconds till round three. I'm coming with you. Three, two, one. Let's go for it. Pick a number you want to get to in your mind. Go get it. Remember we used to do the five minute burpee challenge? Spicy. This is just the 20 second burpee challenge. Three, two, one. We have one round left. One round left. We're going to be all in orange. Oh, who's that guy? There he is. Three, two, last round. Let's go. Three, two, one. Damn, that was actually, I think, five rounds. Good stuff, my friends. Holy moly, someone give me an air five. Good stuff, keep walking. In through the nose, out through the mouth. Let's grab a mat or somewhere on the floor. No, we can relax and cool down and stretch. Fantastic. Let's all come on down, laying on the back. Hands above head. Let's just take a moment and be aware of our heart rate. You earned that heart rate today. You earned it. Can't do that sitting on your butt. No, you got after it today. So give yourself a compliment, something you did well today. What's something that you're proud of about yourself, about your performance? Good, let's wrap those 
hands around your right shin, bringing it to chest, work it around that hip joint. Good, right ankle, left knee for a figure four stretch. Your heart rate should be quite down by now. As we do this deep breathing, switch legs, left knee to chest. Be almost back down to resting heart rate. Left ankle, right knee, pushing down on left knee. Good. From that position, let's just wrap one hand around. The knee drive up to a seated position, flip over for a pigeon pose here. Pigeon pose. So we've talked about transitions today, just really within the household of your different roles. So you just got done with your exercise self. We're finishing here. Now what's gonna be your transition? Is it taking a shower? Is it taking off your heart rate monitor? Is it making a protein smoothie? What is it? that will then start that transition from your exercise self into your next role today. Think about your next role right now. What do you need, who do you need to be next? Who do you need to be next? And then how are you going to be in that role? Is it gonna be with bitterness and resentment or with anger, quick, quick to anger? Or how can you best optimize that role? What do you need to do to yourself? What choices do you need to make in the attitudes you choose to take to best serve in that role? Will somebody thank you? Probably not. But at least you know that you can live with yourself knowing that you played that role to the highest ability possible. Did we switch? If we haven't, let's switch sides. If we have, well, we're just getting a little extra love. Pushing that transition to the next hat. Good, let's drive hips up in the air. Paw the ground with the heels. And walk the feet to the hands. And slowly come on up. Whew. Grab my towel. How we feeling, my friends? Oh, can we get a transition on three? You can unmute yourselves. Feel free to let me know how that was, because that was that was tough. Fun but tough. What do you guys think? It's a really really good use of time, huh? Yeah, we use time wise. That was good. All right, my friends, let's get transition on three, and I'll let you transition on out of here. All right, transition on three. One, two, three. Transition. transition. Awesome. Yay, thank you, thank you, Much love, everybody. Much love. <laughs> Have a safe, wonderful week. And remember, only on Monday, only class is going to be at 9 a.m. with Brian. He'll be in his new house. Cool. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Great Thank job you, today. Ray. Thank you, Ray. Bye. Bye. Awesome. Bye. Thanks. Bye.